find out the value of unknown in the given question. Let's solve the type 3 questions. That is finding the unknowns. Here we can find two mixed fractions given and it is equal to 2. There is a division symbol in between. 17 by 3. On converting the mixed fraction, it became 17 by 3 divided by, I have taken the missing term as x, x 5 by 6. We have written it as it is, which is equal to 2. Now, 17 by 3 divided by x 5 by 6 is equal to 2. Both these are one and the same. Let's transfer this here. 17 by 3 is equal to 2 into x 5 by 6. We need to find the value of x. So, let's bring this here. x 5 by 6 is equal to 17 by 3 into 1 by 2 which is equal to 17 by 6. Now, x 5 by 6, this is a mixed fraction is equal to 17 by 6. On converting the 17 by 6 into mixed fraction, we get 2 5 by 6. On equating these two, we can get the value of x. That is, x is equal to 2. This is the answer. Let's solve another question. A boy reads 3 by 8 of a book on one day and 4 by 5th of the remainder on other day. If there were 30 pages unread, how many pages did the book contain? Let's solve this. A boy reads 3 by 8 of a book in one day. So, part read on one day is 3 by 8. Then how to find the remaining part after one day? By subtracting the part read from whole, which is equal to 5 by 8. So, after one day, the part of the book remaining is 5 by 8. And on the second day, he has read 4 by 5th of the remaining book. So, on the second day, 4 by 5 of 5 by 8, isn't it? This is what is remaining after the first day. So, 4 by 5 of 5 by 8 is equal to 1 by 2. Even after two days, there is some part which is unread. So, the unread part can be determined by 1 minus 3 by 8 plus 1 by 2. This is part read on the first day and the part read on the second day. This becomes 1 by 8. So, the unread part after two days is 1 by 8. Now, he is asking us to find out the number of pages in the book. So, let us take it as x and the unread part is 1 by 8. So, 1 by 8 of x is equal to 30 because he has given that there are 30 unread pages. On equating this, we get x is equal to 30 into 8. So, finally, we get x is equal to 240. Therefore, the book contains 240 pages. This is the answer. Look for what is asked in the question and plan accordingly. Good luck.